The World Health Organization's chief security says the Delta variant of COVID-19 first identified in India is becoming the globally dominant variant of the disease. Sumiya Swaminathan also voiced disappointment in the failure of CureVax vaccine candidate in a trial to meet the WHO's efficacy standard, in particular as highly transmissible variant boost the need for new effective shots. Britain has reported a steep rise in infections with a Delta variant, while Germany's top public health official predicted it would rapidly become the dominant variant there, despite rising vaccination rates. The whole situation is so dynamic because of the uh, variants. Uh, that are now circulating and as you said the Delta variant uh, is well on its way to becoming the dominant uh, variant globally because of its uh, significantly increased uh, transmissibility. We need more data uh, again from well designed studies on the efficacy of the different vaccines that are in use in different countries against the different variants. When you look, um, and any of you can, can look on our website and see the numbers, when you see the absolute numbers, uh, it doesn't appear that our African region uh, is in necessarily bad shape. It's only in the last week represents just over 5% of global cases um, and over 2.2% of global deaths. But given what Maria said about underdiagnosis on the continent, it's trajectory that's very, very concerning. And, and in the last week, we've seen over 100% increases in Namibia and Sierra Leone and Liberia in Rwanda and Zambia and Zimbabwe and Malawi and Lesotho in Congo and South Sudan. We've seen between 50 and 100% increase in cases in places like Mozambique and Cote d'Ivoire. Every region has countries that are now facing a steep increase in cases and deaths. Many countries in Latin America have rapidly increasing epidemics and others have plateaued at high level. In Africa, cases have increased by 52% just in the past week and deaths have increased by 32%. And we expect things to only get worse. Hello. Hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.